Welcome to the Bob and Tam Show today. We got something special. You know, if you're anywhere near the California, Arizona, Nevada area, you know, we got a bike rally that's going to be coming up here real soon, and it's called the Bullhead River Run. So today, we have Larry Topping, which is the promoter for the event, and we're going to find out a little bit about what he's got going on. So, hey, Larry, what's the dates first off? April 26th through the 29th. All right. And uh, you're also not too far away. We're right across the river from the Laughlin. So we got the casinos and all that over there. We've got other things to do other than just if you want to gamble or you got a wife that wants to come along and she don't want to, you know, she want to ride that bike, shove her over there in the casinos, give her some money and right. have well, a lot of fun. We got the river too. The river is right. nice and cool that time of year. That's right. So uh, tell us a little bit about your event. How long have you been doing it? Uh, the, the Bullhead River Run is in its third year now. The 2023 event will be our third annual. Um, I've been uh, putting on the tattoo convention that's happened during the Laughlin River Run for the last 15 years. And since Laughlin isn't happening anymore, uh, myself and some others have picked up the reins of the Bullhead River Run and uh, we're making it great again. Yep, we do have a few bands. We've got outdoor bands uh, at uh, the Anderson Fieldhouse. We've got indoor bands at the Anderson Fieldhouse. Inside Friday the 28th is going to be Count 77 and uh, Little Billman is going to be opening for them. On the 29th, we'll have Slaughter, mm. and Crashing Wayward is going to be opening for them. That should be a good concert. Yeah, I think so, too. And those are all at the Anderson House? Anderson Fieldhouse, yep. So out in the parking lot, uh, we'll have a huge tent, because last year, uh, people were interested in getting shade, because, you know, it's, it's Arizona. Yeah. It's sunny here. And uh, so we definitely got a, a big top tent to go out in the middle of the parking lot out there. And on both sides of the tent will be vendors and, uh, and also uh, food vendors surrounding the tent with our big bar and the stage inside and where we'll have our bands playing inside the, inside the tent. Okay. And do you have areas for people if they want to come out and do some camping? Yes. At the Bullhead City Community Park, we have uh, spaces for RV parking and for dry tent camping. Mm, pretty good. We have three locations this year. And uh, it's the Bullhead City Community Park, uh, which was available last year. And we have Gary Keith Park, that's our new location, and the Anderson Fieldhouse, who, where we were last year. And what are you going to have at Gary Keith? Gary Keith, all, all three locations is going to have uh, music, entertainment, uh, food vendors, and uh, retail vendors. Um, the entertainment will be different from place to place. So, like, uh, we got biker games. And the Miss Mayhem competition going to be happening at the Gary Keith Park. At uh, biker games also happening at the Bullhead City Community Park, and we've got the motorcycle show going to be happening there. At the Anderson Fieldhouse this year, uh, we have moved the tattoo convention from Laughlin and put it inside the Anderson Fieldhouse, and it will actually be happening during the concerts as well. So uh, the the tattoo artists can. Tattoo all through both of the concerts. You also have a benefit ride going on during that time, don't you? We have two benefit rides mm. going on. So we have uh, Mayhem Charity Poker Run on Friday. And uh, this will be the 10th year for the Men of Fire Veterans Poker Run. Last year, they were able to uh, come up with $20,000 to give to the uh, River Fund uh, here for local homeless veterans. Mm. Well, Friday is coordinated by uh, the Mayhem event. And uh, it's, it's going to, our charity for that, the money is going to go to the Men of Fire Veterans Poker Run for okay. support and also to the Moose Lodge, the Elks Lodge, and the American Legion. Mm -hmm. Saturday is the Men of Fire Veterans Poker Run that's been happening for the last 10 years. Do you want to talk a little bit about maybe some of the different riding people can do out here in this area? Um, well, it's all warm. It'll all be warm riding and uh, it'll be dry probably because we don't get a lot of rain here. Uh, which is perfect. So there are many uh, places to go out here. You can go from here and wind up in Vegas in an hour and 15 minutes, or you could uh, wind up in uh, Williams in two, two hours and 30 minutes. Uh, you could wind up in Lake Havasu in about an hour. Laughlin's here. You got uh, uh, lots of great uh, riding. So you got the, the 22 mile loop with the, the, uh, the sidewinder, sidewinder, sidewinder yeah, side right outside of mm -hmm. Oatman, which is the old Route 66. Yes, it is. It's actually the longest stretch from Tupac all the way up to Slegman is the longest consecutive strip of the original Route 66. Yes, it is. 
It's kind of neat. And over in Kingman, there's a lot of really neat places to check out over there. There's an old soda fountain place there that's really nice there. Right across the street from that, it's the museum. Yep, the they train got a lot station. Of, yep, they got a lot of really neat stuff. So there's really a lot of neat things to do when you come out here and ride. And it's a great place. It's a great ride to go out there. They also it got is. the gas station that's out there, which really isn't a gas cool station. Cool Springs. Yep, Cool Springs, which actually was one of the thoughts of when they did a Cars movie. Yep. Yeah, actually, they, it was in another movie that they blew it up. That was a uh, Universal Soldier. Yeah, mm -hmm. and they completely rebuilt it. The guy bought it, rebuilt it, and uh, Ned Luchter. Yeah, I'm actually friends with that guy. He's a Are good you? dude. Yeah, and uh, so it's pretty neat. So there's a lot of really neat stuff to do out here. A lot of great riding to do. Not counting all the stuff Larry's got set up for doing for his rally. Yeah, we're excited. Uh, we're looking forward to seeing everybody out here, April 26th through the 29th. So, do you have any specials that you can get for rooms? Um, we do. On our website, if you go to Places to Stay at MayhemInfo.com, go to Places to Stay, stay on, that, on that page. Uh, if you scroll clear to the bottom, uh, you'll be able to click on a link that finds hotels, and it'll give you the cheapest prices available in the area on hotels. There you go. So it's pretty good. And the sooner you book, the better off you are, that, especially if you're over in California. They used to be, that's what the rally used to be when they used to have the old Laughlin River run years ago. That's where it all started. It used to be a lot of riders came over from California. They wanted to get out and do a little different riding. You know, traffic's not as, it's nothing out here compared to what you have in California riding around. But you come out here and there's some great riding and it's a great community. Uh, we actually live here in this area. And uh, so it's a really great place to be and, and uh, have a and lot of fun. During the rally, the motorcycles are the dominant, yeah. the predominant uh, yeah. motor vehicle on the road. And uh, we have a friendly police department. Yep, uh, we've got actually, uh, quite a good relationship with the police department and they're really excited to have everybody out too as well as the city of bullhead yeah and uh the, especially last year we we couldn't make it because we're down in florida but we had mike there mm -hmm. and uh, he kind of watched it and stuff and he said the same thing he didn't really see anybody getting pulled over or any lights or anything you know you did see the police presence around but you didn't see any hassling or anything like that that used to be over there in laughlin and we are going to be doing the mayor's commencement ride on thursday oh, okay so there's another ride coming on yep. then so you got three rides going yep. on so that's pretty neat. So we wish you all the luck. Hopefully you'll have a great time. There'll be no rain and it won't be super hot because we've been out here and it's been 50 degrees. Yeah. And nobody come here and say the W word. That's right. Yeah. And uh, so it'll be a great time. And uh, so we'll all see you out here at the Bullhead River Run. That's right. Bullhead River Run. MayhemInfo.com. There you go. Thank you all very much. And we'll see you guys on the next video.